The race is over because you're a shit boyfriend. Fact. Shut up, mate. You don't have a clue. You Do you think, think you've been straight with me? The answer's no. You what are you doing? Up? I'm not looking at you. No, look at me. Hey. Hello. How are you? Very well. You look beautiful. Thanks. Loving the, loving the dress. Um, I got some red Thank wine. Thank you so much. No worries. Cheers. Cheers. Nice to see you. You it's too. Been a while. It's, yeah, it's been a while. Mm. I don't know. I just feel like I'm annoyed at myself that I let the pressure of other people get in the way that of just us even just hanging out properly. No, I think I would really like to properly hang out again without all this complication and the pressure and just actually... Would you like it to be a date? Yeah. You, do, you would? Yeah, a proper one. OK. If you, mate, it must be really hard. Obviously, Miles and Ruby are here. Yeah, because I don't think he knows half the stuff that I've gone through and been going through with Ruby. I doubt he knows that she's been messaging me. I doubt he knows that she's been calling me. I doubt he knows we've even hung out. But you guys know, every, like, six weeks, Ruby's been sucking me in to this vacuous cycle of be affectionate to Rez, get his emotional doors open. And the thing is, the last time she did it, which was about three weeks ago, I actually kind of crumbled a little oh, bit. No, no! Listen, listen, I'll be honest with you, we, 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 we've kissed and stuff like that, so I know oh. it's going to disappoint you, but... You have to bear in mind that I was really trying to stay strong, but I did crumble. You know, ultimately, I really love the girl. Yeah, it's so hard for me to say no. Chaps? Hello. I come bearing res. What about Tristan? And Tristan. Long overdue conversation. Yeah, guys, I thought I'd, uh, I'd say guys, Mars. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to understand that you and I probably have an issue. I think you had quite a big part to play in my breakup with Ruby. It's quite clear. Um, Julius, I would say the same for you as well, but I'm really here for Miles. You just decided to go pursue my girlfriend so, at the time that I was with, I didn't and then you use your pals to get into her as well. That's basically what you did. I think you're upset the race well, is over. Opinion. OK, that's fine. You're, just, no, you're no, so no, fucking upset, upset the race is over. over. And you're trying I'm to upset. use us as fucking Jeez. scapegoat. The race yeah, is over because you're a shit boyfriend. Fact. Shut up, mate. You don't have a clue. Do you, you think, think you've been straight with me? The answer's no. You what are you doing? Up? I'm not looking at you. No, look at me. It's Julius, quivering. you're quivering right now. You are a, an a fucking cold. Don't, you're don't a shell of a man. Just relax, you're not that mate. Guy. Point is, you need to relax. I'm talking is. to Miles. Miles, you know you haven't been, you've been uncouth with me, and you know you have, right? You're painting the picture of me wanting you guys to break up because you want me to sweep him or like. Oh, that's exactly what you did. But I didn't. So if you didn't, but I'm not. When this was all going on in the beginning, genuinely, like. I saw her cry every night. So you saw five minutes of my relationship with Ruby of eight years, right? And you pounced on it like a bunch of vultures. It completely fucked my relationship. It's been awful, mate. Do you know what I mean? And yeah, I am hurting about it. I still love Ruby. We do hang out. We've kissed recently. She had a wobble and she was trying to get back with me. Look, I didn't know you guys were, you know, seeing each other again and, you know, hook up, well, kissing or whatever. And she's, you know, trying to get back in there. And I didn't realize that. It was that intense. So, to clear your mind a little bit, right now there is nothing going on between Ruby and I. Like, I'm just now wanting this to like end. So, so what are you saying? Are you sorry or no? No, no, I'm just saying that's it. We can drop it now. Like, I haven't got the impression that you give a fuck. We're not really getting anywhere because I don't think you're ever gonna agree on anything because you don't quite clearly understand what I'm trying to say. I remember jokingly saying to you, ah, "You're not the kind of guy I want to introduce to my girlfriend." Do you now see why? I'm done with it. Catch you guys in a bit. I'm going to go as well, but yeah. Let's chat later. Yeah. Yeah.